Hi, I'm James Richards, helping you to be all you can be, by all that God is. The way. We're looking at the topic of being blessed, or as I like to put it, being satisfied. Blessed points to being satisfied. Uh, I said I was going to jump into the Beatitudes and how Jesus used the word blessed for us to give us another take on understanding the word makarios, which is Greek for the word blessed, which is used. And we use it in many different ways in church. But I feel the need I need to step back a bit because I just want to unpack a little more from the first video. Don't think we were done. And partly that's to do with the fact that I really want us to get this idea of the blessing really being his spirit and nothing else. We read 1 Peter 4, 14. He told us that blessed are the persecuted for they have the spirit of God. Basically. Which answers the question. And it comes up in the Beatitudes because at the end of, uh, I think it's uh, chapter 5, verses 10 or 11, Jesus says, blessed are the persecuted for my sake. Like, what's that about Jesus? What do you mean that blessed are the persecuted? Similar to what I said in Peter. And we're realizing that at the end of the day, it can't be physical stuff, it can't be my health, it can't be favorable circumstances, it can't be my possessions, because all these things can change, all these things can get corrupted, all these things can be taken away from us. Simple as that. So there's no assurance there, there's no comfort there, there's no security in any of it it appears like that but there ain't no it's like if I'm going through a hellish time and my neighbours seem to have it all two cars on the lot kids are doing well money in the bank eat what they want go on holiday when they want all is cush and then I'm here facing I don't know horrific circumstances terminal disease uh not knowing what day is going to bring any more trouble. Yet, I'm doing it with a smile on my face. I'm doing it with joy. I'm doing it with an attitude that says I'm still going to embrace life and engage it even more. Those neighbours are going to ask questions. Those neighbours are going to look at me and think, what does he have that we don't? Now, they may be happy, but trust me, they're going to hit hard times. They're going to hit difficulties. Now, it's the way they deal with these things that help them to see that if they have the blessedness or they don't. You see, for Job, he wasn't blessed because he got compensated. He's blessed because he got through the hell of losing his kids, his wife, his riches, his livestock, his slaves, his, his health, without losing him losing his mind doing something completely stupid which is well within his rights to do that's what makes him blessed in a sense I am talking about so another way you could ask the question in terms of blessedness is this want to think are you satisfied under persecution are you so satisfied with the spirit of God with who lives in you, who you have, that even in tough times, I am still content. Or as we like to say in church, the Lord gives and the Lord takes away. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I've heard that many times, but again, in action, people live as though the things that the Lord takes away is all I've got time for. Can't see them why they're at work. Can't see them why they're stuck with the kids. Can't see. And the thing is, Matthew 6 33, seek ye first the kingdom. And he says this in the context of telling people who are after food and clothes, you need to put God first. He's talking in the context of people who want just the basics, not the rich, extravagant. They just want basics. Quite simply, we don't make time for God. God is our time. 
It's the other stuff we make time for. Nah, I'll unpack that somewhere else. But the blessed person understands that. Why this really encouraged me as well? <laughs> We're not even going to get to Jesus in this video and Matthew 5. I'll do that for the next one. Why this really encouraged me as well, and I want you to hear me, is I realised I'm blessed even before I get bad news. Suffering, pain, battle cannot stop a blessed person because you're blessed by virtue of having his spirit, which happens before the warfare. <coughs> now, you may be going through all this warfare and you've just discovered who God is. Fine. What it does now is give you a different perspective on how to handle the warfare and see the warfare for what it is and realize that as big as your demons are, your God is bigger. If he's really God, you'll see that he is bigger than what you are facing. Does that make sense? So in other words, for us who believe in him, blessedness is not the end. It's not where we get to. It's not what we work for. It's not why we're here. It's where we start. It's what we live with. It's what we experience along the way. It's what we enjoy along the way. Even going through the same hardship as the rest of the planet. Because we do. And I wish we'd be more honest about it. I wish we'd be more open about it. I wish we'd be more transparent. Just, 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 yeah. The only difference between me and someone else in terms of what I experience is Christ. Other than that, we go through the same stuff. Divorces happen, sicknesses happen, bankruptcy happens, children leave, aches and pains, we lose our minds, mental health issues. You can go on and go on and go on and go on and go on. And yet through it all, we are blessed. I like that blessed, don't know about you. I am blessed. When I say I am blessed, that's what I mean. Now, it took a bit of unpacking and we haven't finished. So stay peeled because I'm going to finish this up and look at the Beatitudes, look at Matthew chapter 5 and what that tells us in terms of this same thing when we say that I am blessed. My name is James. This is the way helping you to be all you can be by all that God is. I want to thank you for watching, for supporting. Subscribe if you haven't. Share the video. Let people know we're here because we're really about to go in when it comes to scripture, God, his spirit. I live in this thing for real. Take care. Be all you can be for all that God is. Guys, if you're loving it, please share and remember to subscribe right here at the way.